Hey, what's up guys? It's Angel Koo, and right now we're in one of my favorite areas of Beverly Hills. Uh, it's an enclave called Truesdale Estates. Uh, this area offers nice wide streets, amazing views, and all this greenery you see around us. Uh, we're actually gonna check out a brand new construction with my buddy Paul, who developed this house. Uh, follow me. Hey Paul, what's up? Hello Angel, welcome. Good to see you. Thank you so much for inviting us here to your brand new construction. Uh, why don't you tell us a little bit about it? Yeah, brand new. The uh, city issued the certificate of occupancy earlier this year, right before COVID. And then we shut down, now we're back open. So brand new build, 12 foot ceilings, got the skylight above us. These are automatic Fleetwoods, the other doors open up. Uh, we are walking on volcanic rock. This is basalt stone, so oh, wow. should last for a few million years. <laughs> finishes are great, custom finishes. For instance, this one on the uh, fireplace is called Black Phantom Granite, and it has a textured or leathered finish, so it even feels great in addition to wow. looking great and has the book match. Three car garage has the glass door so you can showcase your automobiles. Wow. And if that's not what you want, then the glass will be tinted, frosted, or smoked. Here we have a European kitchen accented with the skylight over here on the north side, wow. which gives us great light on this tourmaline quartzite, which has incredible depth, has a crystal effect when you look at it, and it's really like a piece of art. What is this called? It's, quartz, it's called tourmaline quartzite. Tourmaline, Tourmaline quartzite. quartzite. It's harder than marble, less resistant to scratching and staining compared to marble. So the cabinets are poke and pole. Germany's oldest cabinet maker going back to 1893, so they have a little bit of experience in making cabinets. <laughs> a few hundred years. <laughs> Walk-in pantry, it has a motion sensor light, so right, let's see. Let's see if it works for All you. Right, going here we go. going further, sensor. maybe you have to wave your arm. There you there go. We go. So it just goes on. Motion you know, sensor. Yeah, now there's two dishwashers here. And if you don't want to open it up manually, like say if you if you had some nail extensions or you just had your nails done. I did then, actually. Well, fantastic. Then you just give it a knock. Whoa. Gaggano wow. with these built-in controls here into the Pogan pole. Oh. So four burners, pot filler. Uh, if you have a wok or anything large, here's another burner. So you've got the, uh, the barbecue, you got the griddle for your pancakes and other things. And this, uh, is, this is five feet, you say, five feet sink? Yeah, this That's is a huge. five foot sink, yep. Wow. Convection oven, okay, regular guess. oven, warming drawer. Oh, wow. Over here, coffee maker, uh, oven, warming drawer. Look at this fridge, is completely hidden. Two Mila refrigerators. Wow. Two Mila drawers with drawers in the drawer, inside of the drawers. So you got drawers inside the drawer you do. of the freezer. Okay, so we're passing by the Zen Garden. We have a Woods Davy Stone sculpture there, hand selected. So this bedroom got staged at the office. It does have the closet behind me. Behind you, it has a three-quarter bath. It's got the, uh, the natural light coming here on the south. It's got the private patio. There is a gate there. You'll go down there, Angel, okay. and push the call button uh -oh. on the right. What is it? Is this an elevator? That's an elevator. Oh, so wow. push the call button. All right, here we go. And Ooh. voila, that goes down to the low level. So there's two staircases and the elevator. Amazing. So Paul, we, we have a basement here. Is that what they're called? I call it the lower level. Okay. Because it has um, a lot of natural light, which is different than most basements. So the designer came up with something really exciting here. There's really three options to enjoy watching movies. There's the traditional method by going inside and then closing up the accordion doors. The other side closes up as well. And you can be inside and close up that door. Or you can be sitting here um, with the counter and the bar stools this way. Or you can be over here at the pool table and be watching something on the screen there and hear it. Certainly somebody could put whatever they like down here. If they don't like this setup for cards and board games, they could put in a ping pong table, foosball table, lots of room here. So this bedroom got staged as the wellness room. Okay. Um, home gyms, of course, have become incredibly popular. So it's room for the Peloton, it's room for the weights or yoga. So here is um, an ensuite bedroom bathroom with custom designer finishes there, a walk-in closet even for guests or children. Um, the zero wedge moldings up and down give it a nice sleek look. The climate grills are sleek. 
So here, a nice area to do work, homework, um, or another yoga area, if that, say, is a home gym and somebody wants to do yoga outside over here. Um, it's beautiful. Oh, so this is a different bedroom. Oh yeah, different bedroom. Okay. This one's slightly larger, so Got it. I mean, these are wonderful um, bedrooms down here because they get the fresh air, they get the natural light. So again, so that's, we came from that. We came yeah. out of that bedroom into this bedroom. Yeah. Okay. So that's why I refer to it as the lower level rather than the basement because right. basements tend to have a negative connotation, yeah. whereas down here it feels great. So there are six ensuite bedroom bathrooms. Only four got staged with beds. One got staged as an office, one got staged as a wellness room. But if somebody wants to go to six, they can do six and they still have all this common area for everyone to enjoy here as well as upstairs. And uh, they can come out, watch the outdoor TV. Of course, they can um, put in a larger one. There's speakers here you know, for the TV. There's speakers under the eaves, the barbecue, the refrigerator, the outdoor dining. So check out this edge. I mean, this is, it's literally, there's zero edge on this floor, right? Zero edge, so there's a small taper, so the water's coming over here. Yeah, got the fire pit, oh, the fire table. Yeah, the fire table for lounging here out at night. You still hear the water. And we've got these stepping pads here between cool. the pool. Water feature steps. And the hot tub, right? Oh, wow, there goes a the hot tub there. Yep. And we have another kind of area just off the master. Yeah? Off the master, sure, yeah. yeah. So this is, Indoor and outdoor space here, right, Paul? These, yeah. these doors just pocketed in. Yeah, those ones are manual, but they're they're light, they're easy. Crestron home automation, including these shades. Um, these shades are a medium uh, density. They can be blackout shades if somebody prefers a complete dark experience in here. So this is the master. This is the master. So we have a few things going on here. We've got Mayan marble here for the countertops. We have the dual showers. We've got a large bench in there. We have two doors that will open up. Okay. That so one, can... and then you can open up that one. Okay. And so you can have the feeling of an outdoor shower by just yeah. opening that up. And it's completely private. Like completely can... private. The property line goes all the way up there so no one can see in. Wow. And we have this tub. Uh -oh. You can fill it with Check the wand out, or you can fill it overhead. Flashes a little bit. And this is the master closet. Yeah, it's very artistic um, it's with the floating shelves. The practical part are the eight drawers on each side of the island and the other eight drawers on the outer banks. Completely customizable if somebody wants more racks for shoes, shelves for shoes. All right, Paul, thank you so much for letting us tour your beautiful home. Um, and thank you guys for hanging in with us. If you guys ever want to see this house, uh, reach out to myself or Paul. Thank you. All right. Air, air bump. Air bump. Oh. It is. <laughs>